Dave Hino, Rhode Island Striped Bass Fishing Hotspot Videos. I'm here at uh, Galilee. I'm on the short wall. Um, this wall and that long wall over there, that's called the West Wall. They form this channel into the uh, salt pond in the co-op Galilee. Uh, anyway, this is prime striper territory. It's a morning bite and a night bite. It's a jetty. You need to fish the lower rocks on the jetty, not way up top here, um, when you can. Uh, you want to fish this before there's a lot of boat traffic or the stripers will be inactive. They're not going to come up for your baits if there's a bunch of guys running through here without ports. Uh, it's a great spot for eels and plugs. The current runs in here very hard, so it's a tough, almost impossible place to jump right here. Uh, and But important, you want to fish when the tide's moving but not ripping. You'll never hold the bottom in a ripping tide here. Here I'm going to address the West Wall. The West Wall is a prime spring striper spot for the schoolie stripers. The, um, the west wind, southwest winds, bring those fish right into that corner. You fish the opposite side of this wall. Guys fish up both for scup and, um, and sea bass too, but early in the spring, that's the first striper fishing. Uh, freshwater tackle, barbless hooks, light, light gear. Uh, and you want to fish the coastal side of that for, for those fish. You want to fish facing westerly. This wall right here, you also want to fish into this channel. You do not want to fish the beach side of this. Maybe down at the very end you can a little bit, but this is shoal and sandy. There's nothing here to hold fish. On this side, you got a lot of rocks, you got a ripping current, uh, and that's where you want to fish. Anyway, um, Dave Hino, Ocean State Tackle. If you want to chunk or catch scup, you can fish further down on this end. I'm going to do a video that features that. All right? Dave Hino, Ocean State Tackle, Rhode Island Striped Bass Fishing Hotspots. Thank you.